cold outside, it's two degrees and it is Vlogmas day four, hello. But look how beautiful this is. So although it's freezing, there's like wintry frost everywhere, like in the countryside here in Norfolk. And this looked really pretty, so I thought I'd um, just drive down here and do a bit of filming. Early one, there was sort of more frost in the air. But it's just lovely, isn't it here? Hello. Hello, you guys. Oh, I didn't bring you any food. It seems you've got something down there though, so that's okay. Well, look, they're all coming, so I better go because I'm being a bit of a tease here. Hanging around with no food. I'll be back next time with some food. Sorry. Oh, they're all coming over. Right, I better go. I'm going to save my chocolate for later and open up the Cap Gibson Advent Calendar. Right, where's number four? Came up very nice. Is that more hand cream? Another hand cream? My hand's going to be so soft. Oh, the trusty fork is here to help. Oh, it's hard with one hand. Here's a little happy Christmassy gerbil hamster. Gerbil or hamster? I don't know. You're definitely a bird. You're a llama. And I think you're probably a, a gerbil. Gerbil or hamster? Oh, I don't know. Anyway, so a little hand cream for day number four. I still haven't found the um, missing chocolate from the advent calendar from yesterday. I don't know where it went. It just... No idea. It skittled off somewhere for a better life. Rufus, I've got something to tell you. I can't find the sage and turkey strips because um, we're having some work done on the kitchen and they've been moved, but I do have a gravy bone. Oh yeah, gravy bone, yeah. What do you reckon? We've got a stinky elf down here. Oh no, not on the couch. Oh no, not on the new carpet. I am sorry it wasn't one of those chewy strips, but they will be back tomorrow when I found them. How's that gravy bone? Is it nice? Oh yes. Oh yes, it's nice. Hello again. I'm in the YouTube corner. Well, it's kind of the YouTube wall now, isn't it? I'm not really in the corner anymore because I'm I'm against the wall. But anyway, it's quarter past 10. It's nice and warm inside my house. It is so cold outside. But the day is beautiful. Like it's really sunny and there's blue skies. It's really nice, but yeah, it's freezing. Um, I'm gonna do my mug of the day. You can probably see my Christmas jumper. I'm not sure where it's from. It's I think I bought it last year, I'm pretty sure. It was Sue Ryder in Great Yarmouth, and I don't know how much it was, I haven't got a clue, but I got it last year. So I was trying to do like a Christmas jumper every day last year, but I don't think I managed it. Um, so I just found this in the um, bag the other day, and I was like, yay, another jumper that I forgot about. Right, so that's my Christmas jumper of the day, and here is my mug of the day. This is um, a lovely Queens by Churchill, the Caravan Trail Festival, Merry Christmas, what it says on the bottom, but I don't wanna show you because um, I'll spill coffee all over me and I keep doing that recently. It was 50p from the RSPCA charity shop in Great Yarmouth on Northgate Street, in case you live locally. And it, it's very sweet, isn't it? It's lovely. I actually got two of these. She had a set of six, but I thought that might be too much even for me. So I was like, I'll just take two. So me and Lee can have like, a, you know, a cup of coffee with our matching mugs. I don't normally like matching, but I think a couple of matching lovely Christmas mugs for 50p is, is good. So this is my mug of the day. Um, I've got a coffee and and I've got a couple of things to show you. So I went to the charity shop this morning. I went to um, Sue Ryder in Great Yarmouth and I found a couple of bargains. I just thought, well, I'll just have a little look because you never know And I had like half an hour. Um, so yeah, I've got some lovely Christmas bits and a couple of a top address and some scarves. So I'll show you all of that in just a second. And I've also got a mystery box um, that I'm gonna show you. It's a, like a collaboration during the vlog with a lovely YouTuber called Kim. So I'll tell you more about her in just a second, but we sent each other a mystery box, but it could only be up to five pounds. I think, did I go slightly over? Yeah, but I called one thing like a fruit. I was like, oh, and you can have a bonus skirt. So I went over slightly, but it didn't really count because it was a bonus thing. So we spent five pounds on each other and I've got quite a lot in this box. It's quite heavy. So I'll open that up in just a minute. This feels like a haul video, but it's not because it's part of the vlog. Um, can you see all of these Christmas decorations in this cardboard box? I'll get a few of them out. Um, it was all three pounds for everything in here because if you watched yesterday's vlog, I bought some decorations for my mum from Poundland. A few years ago, mum gave us all her decorations. She split them between me and my brother. So now she doesn't have any. And she's like, oh, I need some decorations. So we'll obviously give her some of them back, the ones that aren't on our tree. And I bought some from Poundland and then I picked these up and I think they'll be really sweet. She's gonna get a real tree. We might go and do that tomorrow 
buy a real tree from somewhere in Great Yarmouth. Um, I do love a real tree because it smells so nice, don't they? And then we'll decorate it when Toby gets home. Um, but the, yeah, this whole box is £3. There's some really sweet little ones in here. I spied them just at the end, so I think they just come in. I'll I'll show you when I put them on the tree, but there's, I'll just show you a few. This one is gorgeous. He just needs his um, hangy uppy thing. It's a little deer that wobbles. Hello. I'll put some string on him so he can hang up. And there's just quite a lot of nice little decorations um, that needs. Oh no, it has got its little chain. That might have been part of a a long set. So I've got something like that. Oh, this is gorgeous. Oh, these birds are very sweet. There's a few of them. Um, there's a little snow globe snowman toby loves snow globes so he'll really like this little snow globe decoration a little finger went in the air there's just quite a few glittery kind of rose goldy ones so when we do the tree oh this one's nice oh i like that it needs its string fixing again but it's like a little as you can probably see a little wooden one um with a little star on top so just yeah full of cute little decorations um so we'll put these on the tree probably tomorrow if it's not tomorrow it'll be the next day oh that's nice i like that one hello we're festive flowers they were in the box as well the three pound box um and i've stuck another one up there because that was slightly wonky and it was annoying me so i thought if i put a flower there it might distract from the wonkiness i need to replace that i will do um oh these were a pound um there's some more little decorations i think they're probably handmade some little handmade stocking decorations um, what's that? It could be like a, a gift tag, that one. And then there's a little reindeer. What's this? Oh, it's a mini, <laughs> a little mini decoration. I put that on my mini tree because that's for the mini decorations. Um, and lots of little like socks. Oh, little candy canes. How sweet. It's, I didn't know they were in there. They're gorgeous. Little like knitted candy canes. Oh, I love those and some little stockings so i've got four of those little st stockings handmade by someone gorgeous i don't know who but um thank you whoever handmade handmade them or knitted them they're gorgeous they've gone to a very good home so thank you person out there in the world okay this was um quite a good find i don't know how much these are normally but wax lyrical that's quite a good candle make isn't it i'm pretty sure it is and it's, uh, I thought it was a Halloween one. I was like, oh, it's Halloween, but that's okay. And then I got home, I was like, oh, it's a Christmas one. Spiced Clementine. That smells really nice. It smells really fresh. Made in England. I'll have a little look later. Um, but that, I thought that was great. I had to get that for a pound. I've got a couple of scarves. Oh, I've got some more decorations. Oh, I'm going to keep these. Sorry, mum. Oh, these are lovely. I think these are probably, yeah, they're Primark little Disney decorations. They cost me one pound in the Sue Ryder charity shop in Great Yarmouth and um, they were four pounds from Primark. And they're lovely, aren't they? Toby's gonna really like those. So some Disney ornaments, some like little Mickey Mouse heads. And I got two scarves. So I got this one, these were a pound each. They were having like, a, they were doing their pricing and everything was three pounds or less on the clothes. Um, so yeah, this was a pound. This is a Gap scarf. Can see there i think the colors are so nice it's really pretty so it's kind of christmasy isn't it and um also really quite bright as well so uh, yeah i thought that was lovely this lovely primark one which i've already got um but my primark one it's like mustard yellow and it goes it's so cozy and warm this um i don't think oh what did i hit Oh, it's okay. It was only a cracker or something. Um, this is really warm and I, the one I've got is really bobbly, but I love it so much I didn't want to let it go. But this is the exact same one, but with um, no bobbles. I love wearing scarves and you can never have too many scarves or mugs or candles or dresses. Okay, <laughs> I'll just carry on. And this little jumper was £3 and it's got reindeers on. And um, this could count in case I don't have enough as one of my Christmas jumpers. It was £3 and I think originally... It is Matalan, Manta Ray. Oh, I think that's Debenhams, isn't it? It says faithful and true on the label. It says size 14, but that looks quite small to me. But I think it will fit. It's got a few bubbles on the bottom, 
but I can get them with my mother's de-bobbler. I've never used that before, but I'll, I'll have a de-bobble. I just couldn't leave that behind. I just thought it was very, very sweet. Oh, there's some bobbles in the armpit. So I'll, I'll get them off and make it brand new again and wear it. And then I'm gonna finish on this lovely fat face dress. It was three pounds. It's a size 12. You've got no pockets, but I will still love you. You've got some nice sleeves. That's quite, quite a flattering length as well. It's not like bulky or anything that's the pattern so it's just kind of I don't know it looks like a strawberry but I don't think it's a strawberry um yeah and I could wear this in the summer I could wear this sort of autumn or winter I think with um you know like a nice warm long sleeve low neck top underneath so that's the back of the dress there so three pounds for that fat face um dress so that's the charity shop buys that I got today and I spent 14 pounds in total I'm so glad I popped in um, because we needed some decorations for my mum's tree and it's just great finding a few bargains and, and giving to charity. On to the mystery box. Da -da. I really wanted to open it when it arrived the other day but I held back because I wanted the video to be genuine. So this is from Kim who I told you about earlier and her channel is The Feel Good Mum. I'll link it below and I sent her a £5 box or just over because there was a bonus item. So if you want to see what I found for her you'll have to watch her video. I'll link it in the description and make sure you subscribe as well because Kim is lovely. She's really funny and like down to earth and she's just she's a bit daft so if you like some of the silly stuff Stuff I do you'll really like Kim she's yeah just really nice she's a mum she's just normal however she does have like the most impressive Instagram feed she's got over 10,000 followers on Instagram my sort of pictures are a bit more random and a bit they're not like as professional or as I don't know Kim's are just beautiful her pictures and she kind of blends out the background makes it grey and she just has one colour and her outfits are amazing she puts together really good outfits and yeah, she gets some really good buys and she does Primark hauls and she does Primark, like she goes shopping in Primark and shows you around. Um, she does like, really good videos of those and she does vlogs as well. So make sure you subscribe and watch her video after you've seen what she's got for me. Okay, I'm going to open it now. I've got a little, oh, she's not even written on the box so I can reuse that. Thank you, Kim. Okay, I'm going to take the top off. I like this box. There's a little card in here. Because last time I did a video with Amy, Amy being mum, I'll link that video below, um, and we sent each other some stuff, but I lost her card, so I, I read it after the video. But this one's inside, so I shall read it. Okay, so it just says, I think I can read this. Okay, I got this gift box for free as part of a three for two offer in Boots, but don't get excited as there's nothing in here from Boots. <laughs> I've not written on the tag though, so you can reuse it for someone else. Thank you. Just make sure they don't see this video. Hashtag awkward. Right, thank you. Oh, I'm going to have a bit more of my coffee because it might be going cold. Okay, I'm going to open this little card. Oh, my coffee's gone cold. Oh, well. Right, let me open this little card and then... Oh, it looks good in there. I can see something for a pound. Something from next. Right, let's see this little card. I hope I sent her a card. I didn't send a Christmas card. I just sent like... um. A normal card I think I should have sent a Christmas one oh little Santa and oh that's good diabetes UK Tesco um I hope you like the gift as much as I like shopping for them uh from one bargain hunter to another happy Christmas to Kate love for Kim from Kim thank you I'll put that on the wonky picture uh, there you go oh that makes it look a bit more festive right right I'm just gonna get straight in Oh, I just put the prices on. I did that as well, but I used like um, sticky notes. Okay, so 50p from B&M. P.S. Not edible. Thank you. I'll try not to eat these tea like candles. <laughs> oh, you tell that's a mum, can't you? Um, so little Jelly Belly um, tea lights. They smell amazing. They're really nice. Oh, I love it. I do, and I do love a candle. So 10 scented tea lights for 50p. That is a really good bargain. Okay. Oh, this looks lovely. I don't know what it is, but I just love it because it's packaged really cute. And it says, it's some socks. <gasps> Cotton socks. I need socks. Thank you, Kim. I lose my socks and I need them. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to read this. Okay. It's a little note. Oh, I don't want to rip the note. Socks is not, oh, socks, exclamation mark. It's not Christmas without the gift of socks. I don't think I got you any socks. Oh no. Um, five pounds down to one pound and it's in a star. A bash star, but it, what do you expect for a quid? 
Hashtag just a quid. I think just squint. Oh, just squint. <laughs> I do anyway, because I can't see with my stupid eyes from next. I love that. I want to put it on the tree, but I want to open the socks. What do I do? What do I'll open them. Okay. All right. Let's get into the socks. I've, I've ruined the star, but it was bashed anyway. Oh, I love them. They're so cute. And they're quite thick as well with little pink trim. I do love socks. I love getting socks. No other people find that boring, but I genuinely love getting socks. Um, so thank you very much for those. So it's £1.50 so far. I spy a mug. All right, what else? I love the little notes. I didn't, my notes aren't as funny as hers though. Mine were just like, this is 50p. Um, part of three for two. But her, her notes are good. Okay, this is Primark. Oh, it's cute. So down to a pound for that little um, Primark. I think it's a wallet or a card holder. Oh, hang on, I've got some hair. It's a little note. I love this, I love this. Can we do this again? Okay, oh my God, I found a Gucci card holder for a pound. Hashtag Primark reduced to one pound from three. It does look like a Gucci one. In fact, I don't even know what a Gucci one looks like, but um, Kim is stylish, so she would probably know. <laughs> That's really cute. Oh yeah, I can put my cards in here. That's a brilliant, do you know what? I needed this and I didn't even know because I've got a little purse, a Kath Kidson purse, I put my cards and money in, but the money doesn't fit with the cards and I'm scared when you get your card out, the money flings out because the new money is all like paper, isn't it? And it just it can fly away. So I will keep my cards in there and then, and maybe my like, coupon -y voucher things in there and my coins in my purse. I, I really like that. Thank you very much, Kim. I've read that one. And there's a couple more things in here. Oh, I did really, I thought I did as well. Oh, I love this mug. I don't have it. It's from B&M, isn't it? Okay, right. Oh, I'll just chuck some stuff out. I don't know if there was a note. No, let me see this. Uh, uh. Oh, this is, I don't want to rip the note. Okay, oh, it's well wrapped. This funny. what's this? Okay. Oh, this is a long note. Oh, you've taken loads of care with this, thank you. And here we have it, the mug of the day, said in the mug of the day voice. You knew you were going to get one, right? Yes, I was hoping so. I scrolled through your Insta for ages to see if you have this one, but I couldn't see it. Therefore, if you do not have it, can you just pretend <laughs> or, and just say it's the best mug you've ever seen? I hope it gets you in one piece. Or it could be the broken mug of the day. Oh, I love that. No, I haven't got this mug. You did really well. It's a b and one, isn't it? Or Tesco. What's it? Oh, there's something else in here. Hang on. And here it is, my £1.49 b and m pineapple goldy, gorgeous, good vibes mug of the day. I love that mug and it will be on my Instagram soon, but probably like after Christmas, Christmas because they're for the Christmas mugs of the day. And I've got some little chocolates here, some little... Um, snowmen and snowball chocolates and there's another little note in this okay a little treat for Toby oh not in the challenge that's really thoughtful Toby um, will love that thank you and there's one more thing left the box is still intact I love that box I'm gonna put someone's present in there okay oh this looks nice all oh, right see what this is it's some kind of a little ornament Hello, it says hello. I really, really like that. That'll be really nice with a picture with a little mug and um, a little hello. Or oh, they go really nicely together because they've got the gold. Oh, thank you. Right, let's see what the note says. That was a pound, that's amazing. I would have absolutely bought that for a pound. I think that's next as well. There it is, in half price sale. And the little note says, I love these little notes. I can see this on your interstate. I just thought that with the picture. Oh my God, you've written. How weird is that? You've written that as well. I can see this on your Insta page with a mug of the day. I got one too. Ha. Eight pounds reduced to one pound. Bargain from Next. Fancy. Actually, it was Next Clearance. Oh, that is brilliant. How funny that I said I'll do a picture with the mug of the day and then you wrote that too. Oh, that's lovely. Thank you so much, Kim, for all of this amazing, amazing, um, amazing bargains for a fiver. So it just goes to show you don't have to spend a lot and you can find bargains, but you know, if you just put thought behind things, you can you can get some great things and everything in this little um, mystery box was so well thought through. I hope mine was as well. I'm just trying to think what I found. 
hopefully hopefully she liked her gifts and if you want to see um, what I bought for her have a look I'll link it below as I said so click on that after you've watched this video and you can see the items that I bought for Kim and I didn't include my gift box as well because <laughs> it weighs around the five pounds and it's been such a nice morning um this afternoon is gonna be a bit different because um I'm driving my mum to Papworth um, because she's got a heart condition so we're going to go to Papworth and she's going to have a couple of checks um, like routine checks as she's been going there for a couple of years now so like every few months so we are going to Papworth so that's what we're going to be doing this afternoon so I'm not sure if I'll speak to you during um, when I'm there because it's probably a bit inappropriate to film in a hospital but if I don't speak to you at some point I might get mum to say a little hello say hi to YouTube hello YouTube it's vlogmas day four today hello vlogmas day four <laughs> it's about seven o'clock now we're back from Cambridge the checkup went really well so every three months um mum goes to Papworth and we just have a chat with them and uh, yeah it was good uh, reassured mum and everything's everything's all right um so it's seven o'clock and I've got a hot chocolate a steaming cup of hot chocolate I'm not even going to tilt this because in the last couple of videos I've spilt my drinks when I've like showed them a bit of steam and can you see the steam so I'm gonna have that that's from Little by the way Little do a really nice um light hot chocolate um and it's in like a blue tub it's only like one pound 19 it's it's really good and I've still got the same mug of the day because it would be wasteful if I went and got another one um so I'm gonna end the vlog here I hope you enjoyed today what did we do so obviously went to Cambridge um and this morning oh I got those charity shop bargains which I was so excited about the little like wax lyrical candle and the fat face dress and the decorations and those Disney ones from Primark are lovely as well and all the gorgeous gifts from Kim and as I said her channel will be li will be linked below um so do go and watch the video see what I got for her and subscribe to her channel too because she's just lovely and there's another video for today as well a home bargains haul with Mr Carrington so that'll be on at seven o'clock um and I've still got my scarf like I said when I put scarves on I don't know if it's just me I never want to take them off because they're just really cozy this one was from um, Sue Ryder Charity Shop as part of like a three for two thing. Um, and it's just really, yeah, really cozy. So thanks for watching. I've lit my candles. I'm gonna relax for the evening. I say relax, I've got to edit all my videos and stuff and get this one ready for Wednesday. That's right. Thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope you're enjoying my Vlogmas so far. If you did enjoy it, give it a like. And if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you do. I would really appreciate that. So I will speak to you tomorrow. I'm going to drink my hot chocolate now. It smells really nice. Okay, thank you. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye.